Okay, so it's not the end of the world? Alright, good. Well, it might as well be because SNSD ruined my life again. Now, unless you live in a cave or don't have any internets, you would've heard about this shit. Of course, I'm talking about SM revealing SNSD's Dancing Queen MV. And to you guys who might have not known, this was supposed to be the lead single the year that G came out. So that explains why in the MV they had to rewind to 2008 to, uh, yeah, to show you guys that awesome glory. Now, as good as the girls looked and the way they danced and their outfits and all that, I'm personally not a fan of that kind of cat. Now I'm not gonna lie, Duffy and SNSD did great renditions of the sample, but what initially drew me to K-pop was how not western it sounded. I personally just prefer the kind of catchiness you hear in like G, Paparazzi, Mr. Taxi, shit like that. But I wasn't disappointed, oh no. I got to witness the girls again in their element, so I cannot complain. So thank you SM for an early Christmas present, but what we saw at the end of that MV was an even bigger Christmas present for me. Like of course you guys caught that. Like when they fast forward back 2013, there's I got a boy. And like the hotness in the, the room, you know, like their auras were coming out of my computer screen, you know? Like I started to sweat from that, you know, legit. Like I couldn't handle the way they was eyeing the camera. You know, the cool hair, the cool outfits, like, it was just too much. And on top of that, that song sounds like it's actually gonna be legit in terms of what my ears like to hear. Like, I hope it's as flashy and electronic -y as that Japanese flower power stuff, because that was just off, that was bananas. And Sunny's purple hair is just out of control. So yeah, that's definitely gonna be the best New Year's ever when that drops. I'd also like to see them perform it on like New Year's Eve or something. That'd be so cool. Like I'm feeling it guys, I think SNSD's gonna have another legendary year, you know what I'm saying? So let's keep our fingers crossed for the girls. I'm not sure if they'll need it because, you know, they never disappoint. But you guys should continue to support greatness like I am. So yeah, it is what it is. Thank you for all the support once again. I think that about does it for me until there's more crazy other news or until the MV drops. And if you guys don't catch me before Christmas, well then Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, enjoy whatever you celebrate. So hopefully I hear from you soon. But right now I'm going to take a look at Hyoyeon's teaser images again. So bye.